A big day on Capitol Hill as Attorney General Jeff Sessions prepares to testify before the Senate. Sessions praised President Donald Trump and fellow cabinet members during a meeting yesterday. This as he prepares to be grilled by the Senate Intelligence Committee later today. Reed Binion has more from the first full meeting of the president's cabin. President Donald Trump holding a round table with his full cabinet, a chance for them to outline department activities in their first months on the job. And we're going to discuss our various reports. But as cameras rolled, the leaders spoke not about the specifics of governing. Instead, one after another, they heaped glowing praise on Trump, starting with Vice President Mike Pence. The greatest privilege of my life is to serve it. As vice president to a president who's keeping his word to the American people. Cabinet secretaries offering similar kudos. My uh, privilege to be here, uh, deeply honored. I want to congratulate you on the men and women you place around this table. Others, notably Defense Secretary James Mattis, pointedly focusing praise on those serving under them. It's an honor to represent the men and women of the Department of Defense. Democratic Senator Chuck Schumer and his staff making a parody of Monday's cabinet level gushing. Thank you for the opportunity and blessing to serve your agenda. The episode had parallels with questions raised about Trump's emphasis on personal loyalty after last week's testimony by fired FBI Director James Comey, who said he declined Trump's request for a loyalty pledge, a request that Trump's lawyer, Mark Kasowitz, says the president never made. He never said it in form, and he never said it in substance. Monday's cabinet meeting also coming ahead of Attorney General Jeff Sessions' Senate testimony. Democrats expected to grill him on Comey's testimony about Trump's conduct and about his involvement in Comey's firing despite his recusal into the investigation into Russia's 2016 election meddling. I'm Reed Binion reporting. A friend of the president's says Trump is considering firing Robert Mueller, who's leading the special investigation into Russian meddling. A senior White House official didn't deny it, but insists that the friend did not speak to the president.